What's up everyone? Some big news just came out about the Pokemon TCG and I want to start a discussion about it. If you don't know what I'm talking about, let's get into it right now. Okay, so if you go to pokebeach.com, um, they posted this article. And as the title says, there's a booster pack configuration change. So... Uh, you know how each pack is now like four dollars and forty nine cents versus the what three ninety nine it used to be, so right here, right? Well, they're changing things where you're going to get three guaranteed foil cards to compensate for this change. Okay, what does that mean specifically? So each pack, from starting from Scarlet and Violet, is going to have two reverse holo cards and one holo card so in each pack you are guaranteed two reverse holo cards and one holo card that's a good thing right right maybe well let's just keep going we'll talk about it um and then the order the order of the cards is going to be changing so um now it's going to go as follows four common cards then three uncommons, then two reverse hollows, and then one hollow, and then you get the basic energy and the code card. So I like that change. I like the change of the order because then you know exactly where the, like those things are going to be. Yes, there is a there's a pack trick right now, but this just makes more sense where the cards that you're trying to find are at the end of it already. You don't have to do some four to the front or whatever it is. Um, you can just take out the code card and the basic energy from the back and you're done. And then you could just go through and then, oh, the cards that you want are at the very end. And I'm pretty sure that's how um, Yu-Gi-Oh! is. I have not opened packs in a while. So, I yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how it already is. So, that just makes it more exciting. That's just, it, it's just better that way. And you don't need to do, like, the four in the front. Or if they change it one day to some other thing with different packs. No, no, this is, I like this. Okay. So, now, if you pull... What they're calling an illustration rare or a special illustration rare, both of which are considered secret rares, uh, they're going to take the place of the second reverse hollow slot. And then you can also have, uh, they, they also have the single double gold colored stars, respectively, for their rarity symbols. So uh, that's for these two types of rares. And then they give you examples over here that you can look at. So let's see, there's one that's illustration rare hollow. This is a special illustration rare hollow. And then this is the one, the Japanese one, or Japanese version. Then the rest of the secret rare cards are going to be in that hollow slot. Um, and then that hollow slot can contain either a rare hollow, a double rare hollow, or which is a regular Pokemon EX, an ultra rare hollow, which is a full art, or a hyper rare, which is going to be a gold card. Um, and then they give you examples over here. All of these. I like this. That's a beautiful art. That's another beautiful art. Um, and then they give you like different scenarios of what you can pull and this and that, which you can read through. Now, as I mentioned, like about the pack order, it increases the suspense as you reach the rarest cards at the end of your booster pack. And then for streamers, the updated, car updated card order will make it easier to show the rarest card at the end of, the pa of each pack opening, which yes, I like it. And then they talk about the pack trick. Um, and they also the end, uh, announced the end of non hollow rares so that's good right that's good all rares and higher rares will now be foil very good especially for little kids right the, everyone wants shiny cards like come on i mean it's, it's a children's card game anyways but you know all the adults love to like to collect and all that kind of stuff but um let's see anything else and then rainbow rares are also gone to celebrate uh, to the celebration of many fans i mean whatever i don't i'm not celebrating about it because you know some some of the rainbows are really nice but whatever um let's talk let's talk so one i already mentioned how i like the order okay fine but i don't like this to compensate part okay they're getting rid of the non-hollow rare so that you're gonna get more hollows but doesn't that mean that the value of those hollows is gonna go down because you have more of them supply and demand isn't that what that means like Come on. And this also does not mean that you're going to have a higher chance of getting the cards that you want. So 
let's just say there's a secret rare and it's a hundred dollars. Do you actually think they're going to increase the ratio um, to give you a better chance to get that hundred dollar card? No, absolutely not. So this whole thing to justify the price increase, it, it's not going to run. It's not going to go past me. It's not going to happen, but maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Maybe it's, maybe it's a good thing, but that's why I want to start a discussion. I want to hear your thoughts in the comments down below. I want to know what you think about this. What do you, first, do you agree with the price increase? Obviously, no, no. You better not agree, agree with the, the price increase. Second, um, do you think that this is a good form of compensation for the price increase? At least, you know, I'm going to give something to them. At least they did something. At least the, comp the Pokemon company did something with the price increase. Instead of just like, hey, we're going to increase the price and it's, everything's going to stay the same. Good thing that they did this at, at least, okay? But what they need to do is make it easier to pull the cards that you actually want, the higher value cards. But that's the thing. If they're easier to pull, then they're not going to have as much value. But this whole thing is about getting the cards that you want. So it's see, this is why there needs to be a discussion. It's a back and forth. Um, it's like a whole circle. So, yeah, that's the news that came out. But again, I want to know what you think. So please comment down below, like, share, subscribe, all that. I am currently sitting at 798 subscribers as of making this video. Um, that means two people are slacking out there and not hit, get, uh, not trying to get me to 800. So if you are two of you are part of the two, please hit that subscribe button. I'd appreciate it. And also, there are now 202 people that are slacking and preventing me from getting to 1,000. So if you're a part of that 202, please hit that subscribe button. Um, and then I'm just going to keep going. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 10,000, 100,000, whatever it is. I have high, I have high, I just set very high goals for, for, uh, for myself. So, um, I appreciate everyone that's been watching and subscribing and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, please let me. We're almost, we're almost get there. we're almost at 800 let's let's get to 800 so let's get there please let's get there um and then that big thousand mark all right that's it i'm just gonna put this video together and then i'm going to i don't know maybe finish watching the uh attack on titan special that just came out in the final season and then i'm gonna go to sleep because i'm on nights and it's nine something a.m right now which means it's nighttime for me even though it's daytime outside yeah have a good day or night or whatever it is yeah for you so deuces